Big wave riders are a breed unto themselves. They are a relatively small group of individuals that do things that we can only dream of doing. With such a tight-knit group and sharing what they share, it's a heavy blow when one of their ranks leaves this existence. On Friday, June 15th, one of Big Wave Surfing's true individuals, Jay Moriarty, most known for his performances in the cold water of Mavericks, died in a freediving accident in the Maldives Republic. Jay Moriarty, to me, was the, kind of represented the heart and soul of Big Wave Surfing, um, you know, especially in the lineup of Mavericks. You know, he's kind of like everybody's anchor. You know, he's out there. You could always count on uh, Jay's smiling face in the lineup. You know, it wasn't about you know competition or getting the you know most coverage or anything like that. It was he was doing it for all the right reasons. Going back to the you know big wave heroes of the 50s and 60s. You know, it was all about the camaraderie and you know pushing yourself. And um, you know, we actually paddled out for our first times at Mavericks on the same day. It was uh, back in April of '94, and um, ever since then, you know. To me, he's just—he's always kind of been my gauge for for where I should, you know, uh, not push it too far. Because if, uh, if Jay was scared, I knew that I should be scared too, you know. And uh, I'll definitely miss him. It'll, it'll never be the same uh, surfing big waves again without. You know, I'll never be able to not think about Jay every time I take off. Evan's sentiments have been echoed around the surfing world by those who know him well and by those whose lives he touched. He will definitely be missed. I just